a massive thank you. <clears throat> a massive thank you for being so patient on this series. GTA Vice City Definitive Edition Part 2 is here. If you guys could be awesome, I super appreciate all the love and support with the big fat like button. And uh, let's do this. I am ready. Ready and rocking. Tommy Vassetti is going to work out who took his drugs and his money. He's going to work it out. I promise you that. Now look here, son. I got a problem and I reckon you could help me with it. I'm no builder. No, I was thinking more of your demolition skills. Now this here, this is the development as planned. And this, this is the property that we're looking at. You're trying to say this new office block is kind of in the way. You catch on quick. Now, I'm going to head out of town for a while, and if that office development would have faced sudden and insurmountable structural problems, then I... As a civil-minded individual, you feel obliged to step in and save the rejuvenation of an important area of the city. Where can I get more guys like you? Okay. I'm worried about this one. All right. I'm getting horrible flashbacks. What's happening here? Horrible, horrible flashbacks. <laughs> oh no. Hopefully, with this definitive definitive version of the game, quote, <laughs> some people disagree with that, um, this might not be too bad, but we'll see. There is some horrific missions in these games, like in a horrible, horrible way. Oh man, I'm getting flashbacks already. Oh boy. <laughs> Let's just try and do it. If we can do this first time, I'll be so happy. Press circle to drop the bombs off. Okay. All right, let's blow this place up. There's things, there's places in the way. There is uh, the occasional guard. So I've got seven minutes and 30. It doesn't sound too bad, does it? Hopefully we can do it. I just remember getting lost. And just not having a not have not having great piloting skills at all. So there's one over there. Let's get that one first. We've got plenty of time. What a way to start this episode, by the way. We were a pretty tricky mission. What the? Oh. What the? Hopefully, I can drop it off. Yep, yeah. it's done. I'm pretty sure you can use the blades and you can just cut them down. Which is a little bit aggressive. That was the easy one. The next couple are going to be a lot trickier. Yeah. I'm never sure, by the way, whether to go just for the top one first or basically what I'm doing now. Do it floor by floor, start at the bottom and then slowly increase. There we go. Oh, that guy's chasing me. You dick. What was that? Oh boy. <laughs> right, I think we drop it off around here. Look at those wood textures. Yes. See you later. Okay, so far, so good. We're doing alright. I'm pretty sure there's a more difficult RC mission in San Andreas. I think it is, potentially. I'm pretty sure there's another one in Vice City as well. Also, in case you missed it, um, I've already uploaded the whole of GTA 3 Definitive Edition. It is up on the channel. It is ready to be watched. You guys fancy it? I actually think that game is um, highly underrated and overlooked. It was a good time playing it again. Uh, was it perfect? No, <laughs> definitely not. And I do want to apologize. I know, um, particularly with the very first episode of San Andreas, I was quite um, hyped. Um, I was playing it. I was one of the first people to ever play it. Um, Oh, 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 that was naughty. Like in the world, I, I uploaded it as, as quick as I could. I'm seeing shit. 
and I, I was very, very excited. I, I, I still, so this, I still like the definitive edition, but yeah, it's definitely um hasn't quite delivered on what we probably would hope from Rockstar. Let's be honest. That's a bit naughty. Should be shooting a helicopter. That's cheating. I've got one more bomb, and we have. Oh, oh, ow, ow, ow. Got plenty of time to go. So, uh, fingers crossed. Yeah, I, I really, I want, I do wonder if someone at Rockstar even tested the game, honestly. Because it's got Rockstar as a publisher, and that's a big deal. Like a Rockstar game is a big deal. Whether it's a, a remaster or a, re a remake or a new game, it's a massive deal. And they've definitely lost uh, some trust there a little bit. I don't think they've lost fans. I think people are still going to be buying GTA 6, for example. But there's going to be an element of maybe some people will be like, I'm going to wait for reviews now. I won't pre-order it, which I completely get. Whoa! There is so many workers trying to track me down and kill me. Upstairs again. Oh, oh he got me. That was cheeky. We're on the right floor. I think. I hope so. Right, this is us done. We actually did it pretty easily. Woo -hoo -hoo! Whoopsie. Kaboom! I thought the game was going to crash there, honestly. <laughs> it's like one FPS. 1,000 for that? Uh, that's a bit mean. I get it, though. I get it. At least that, build that building's gone now. So uh, my man can step in and save the day. Save Vice City. I'm sure he'll step in very quickly. Don't worry about the apps. With the most smallest amount of money possible. Right, this is... Is this Cortez guy? The guy that owns the boat, basically. He has a, a sort of invested interest in my... My money and my drugs, and I don't know why. He's been very friendly. I'm sure he's going to want something in return. Mr. Versetti. Colonel. Thank you for coming. Please sit. Lobster. No, thanks. Uh, I am ashamed to admit that one of the causes of our mutual problem appears to have been the loose tongue of a man I used to trust. I've been carrying Gonzalez for years, but now his incompetence reaches new heights. It's only right that you kill Gonzalez. Did he do it? It's the money that's important to me. For this kindness, I'll reward you. And then, we will find your money together. He will be at his penthouse, half drunk probably. Use this. You want me to use a chainsaw? All right, that's a bit graphic, but fair enough. This guy's got a bit of um, bit of a bit of a loose mouth. Bit uh, that doesn't know when to shut up, basically. So we're gonna permanently shut it and then feed it to the sharks. <laughs> uh, oh, what are you doing, you lunatic? You absolute loon. Yeah, like stuff like the obviously the palm trees, the grass, for example, the vehicles. So you saying about the vehicles, there's a lot of um, a lot of roll in in the vehicles. It, it just seems to want it like it wants to roll over all the time. It's a bit weird. Um, it's, it's, I don't know. I feel very conflicted right now. I really do. There's elements that I love, and of course, there's some things I would like to see changed. I think this version definitely has potential with a few patches. Hopefully. They can steer it in the right direction. Um, yeah, it, it feels a bit rushed, feels a little bit lazy, um, but it's still, I don't know, it's, I'm, I'm still enjoying it and, and there's still a good improvement there, for sure. I mean, surely this is a club right now. I'm gonna walk in, no, it's not the club, sorry, ignore me. I was gonna say the guards are gonna not be very happy. 
this is the place apparently. Got a chainsaw, and I'm not afraid to use it. <laughs> that is terrifying. I had it for you. One, Hello. Two. Is that the guy? I'm gonna shut that big mouth of yours. Both see hey, your nose. He's in. got a blade. <laughs> oh, yeah, I've got a blade. Don't worry about that. Come here. Oh, where is he? Come back. Where's he going now? Oh, sweet Jesus. I've wasted my life and my looks. I've wasted my life and my looks. Stand still and I'll make it quick. Come back. Is that guy still chasing me? You can try, fool. Get out of my oh, he way, missed. Dick. Come on, Tommy. Speed up. Double, double. But you're squealing. No one cares. Come on. The guy behind keeps missing. Oh, I got him. Oh. The Vice City Police are on to me. Not massively surprising, is it? Oops. Get into a vehicle. Get out of here. Paint and spray. I mean. Yeah, I deserve to be arrested, let's be honest. Oh, lose one star. Lovely. Greasy pirates. I always forget that is actually me bribing the police. It's not like I've magically lost the police. It's I'm paying the money. Anyway. Paint spray. Lose that one star. Done! Considering I paid... A hundred dollars to paint and spray the car. That's a little annoying. Oh well. Right, Mr. Colonel again. Let's go and visit him to see what the next plan is. So in GTA 3, you can't actually do this. I will show you now. You can't do that. <laughs> but why didn't they add that to GTA 3 Definitive Edition? Because it's normally what you you'd expect that to be in the game, right? But yeah, that is kind of weird. Anyway, I've still got my chainsaw. Life is good. More shootout. Hmm? Tommy! What is he eating? Come, and join me! This looks delicious, huh? Copy a snout. Oh, no, no, no thanks. Tommy, you are like a pompous breeze that has freed me from the stench of corruption. Although, I must appear to mourn his passing and carry on with business as usual. This isn't getting me any closer to my money. Tommy, my friend, you are not in liberty now. Here, we do things differently. I will continue with my inquiries, but in the meantime, I have a valuable deal to close. A favor for a friend, Cortez? You're a good friend, Tommy. I knew you would not let me down. I need you to meet a courier who has obtained some valuable technology for me. Again, I do want to apologize. Um, that cutscene, for example, the music just plays, despite the fact I've turned the music off. So I have to try my best to edit that music out, but obviously it's not as crisp, the audio, so I do apologize. That is not the definitive edition. Uh, that is me editing, basically. Um, do apologize. Uh, we do need some weapons. How much ammo do we have? So I could probably do with some, actually. Yeah, let's go and buy some weapons. Improve my arsenal. Yeah, so I want to make that completely clear. If something sounds a bit off in the cutscene, it's more 99.9% .9 of the time, it's, that's, that's me. <laughs> that's my fault, basically. Um, I don't know why GTA does that. Again, a bit, a bit lazy. Ooh. Out of stock. Could buy some fresh armor. Yum. Yeah, I think that should be enough. Yeah, I'm pretty happy with that. Should I buy armor? Uh, I know where I can get some actually for free, but I think I will buy it because I'm lazy. Let's buy some armor. Lovely. I might be old, but Very I'm nice. Right, we can do drive-bys. Apparently, if you just look in a general direction, it should pick it up. 
so. Shoot out that way. Yeah. I think it works. So I don't need to, like, press circle or square or whatever. Am I going the right way? Why does it tell me to go that way for? Is that to get ammo? To get weapons? I've got, I've got, I've got ammo and stuff. I'm good. It's all good, don't worry. I think we're going in. Are we going in? I believe we are. Welcome to the mall. Oh, is that my target? Use the old chainsaw, right? Surprise! She's très wet this time of the year. What? Ah, uh, come Where on. Where am I? Look, oh, Cortez no. sent me. Just give me the damn chips. Oh, d'accord. Please, imperialist Can American pig. That is propriété of a gouvernement français. Hand it over. You American idiot. They followed you here. Ah. Whoops. Where's he gone? Where's he gone? Oh, there's loads of them. Ah, run! Oh, he's fleeing. Ah! Get in this vehicle and run him over. Give me my chips back! Where is he? He doesn't look that far away, apparently. Good. Hey! There we go. I'll take those. Thank you. Take these back to the colonel. Oh, I've got two star cops. I didn't realize. My extreme riding skills. Ah! How he stayed on there, I don't know. Wow. That's actually quite impressive. The police car has just come out of nowhere. <laughs> Colonel, here is your chips. Enjoy. Done. Five hundred dollars. The Colonel again. Why not? He's got a very nice boat, by the way. Thomas, I appreciate your coming. Forgive me for getting straight to business. Diaz has asked me to oversee a minor business transaction. Let's hope it goes better than last time. Which is why I thought of you, my friend. I've dropped some protection at the multi-story car park. Pick it up, then go and watch over Diaz's men at the drop-off. Gracias, amigo. Diaz, huh? Apparently that angry midget runs this madhouse. Let's see what that creep has to do with things. Angry midget. <laughs> He's got a point. He's got a point. So Colonel's arranged some um, firepower for, for me to provide some cover. This deal has to go well. Whoa! What are you doing, cop? I guarantee, if I run him over there, that would have been two stars instantly. What a joke! This is the place. Yeah, yes. Ooh, that's more like it. The big guns are coming out to play. Oh no. It's Lance Vance. The coolest name ever. Hogging all the action, I see. Look, you want to do something other than just shadowing me everywhere? Why don't you come along and show me if you're any use? I might just do that. The name's Lance, by the way. Lance Tommy Vance. Bussetti. Let's go. Lance Vance. Go with Lance to the drop off point and watch over Diaz. Got it. I'll take your vehicle as well. Lance fans. Coolest man in the world, Lance fans. This guy obviously features heavily in uh, Liberty City stories. No, Vice City stories. I always get that confused. Because the main character is actually his brother. Yeah. Man. 
I still don't think I finished it on the channel yet. It's the only 3D GTA game I've not done on the channel. I know. Shame on. Let's watch over this deal. Uh, okay, that didn't work. <laughs> Is my car in the way? Do you mean to get my gun out? There we go. He is actually quite small, isn't he? Must be new gun until more gainful opportunities arise. He'll be here any minute. We both better get a good vantage point. Okay, I'll take the balcony. You get the roof across the yard. All right. I like this plan. Let's do it. This is going to go wrong, isn't it? I mean, it's GTA. Nothing ever goes well. Oye, chico, eso no puede ser. I said, you understand me now? Who's this? Always something, man. Whoa! Hello. Yeah, it's still alive. Dead, there's more, there's more. Mow him down. We good. Is there more? Oh, there's more. Come from behind this time. I guess they weren't expecting us. Diaz has been here a little bit. Too much though. Not quite done yet. Oh, they're taking the the briefcase again. Come on. You kidding me? Don't just stand there, you pricks. Chase that dickhead. Alright, all right. chill out, mate. Chase, 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 chase. You cheap bastard. Can I take that? Yes. Get on, get on, go, go, go. Go, go, go! Don't mind me, coming through. Coming through. There he is. Oh, I think I hit his fire already. Good shooting. Sit down. Beautiful. Another deal that went wrong. Luckily, we was there as backup. And we was going rapid through these alleys. It was a little bit intimidating. But I made it work. Coming through. Beep. I did it. I live, dickheads. And it's all down to you. What is your name? Tommy. I see you soon, amigo, I think. See, that should bring enough Shit. loyalty. Where's that guy, Lance? Hey, where did Lance go? Enough loyalty to last me the whole game. I, I saved that man. I saved him. But we all know that's not going to be the case, is it? Loyalty in GTA just does not exist. At all. Apparently, we have no missions available. Oh. There we go. <laughs> Right on cue. Tommy, it's Ricardo Diaz. Oh, I want no. to thank you for looking out for me, my man. I asked that prick on set. He said you're the real deal, my friend. Will you not come see me? I need a guy like you. All I have now is dickheads. Dickheads everywhere, yo. I make you real rich. All right. I'll meet you. And if I remember correctly... Yep. Oh, yeah. We're going to the probably the most iconic location in Vice City. Absolute sight to behold. Probably the best location in this trilogy. The mansion. The epic mansion. Oh boy. A lot of stuff happens here. A lot. 
It's the real start of our Vlasity journey. This mansion is humongous. Where's Lance Vance? I think he already works with uh, Diaz anyway, so he's probably already here. The chase. What chase? What are we chasing? Come on, baby, come on! Yeah! Yeah! Stupid horse! I'll chop your head off! Who is this dickhead? Tommy Versetti. You remember me. Excuse me. I'm a little anxious. Never trust a goddamn horse! You do a good job. You work for me now. I work for money. As I said, amigo, you work for me now. I work Shut for up! Me. Some Judas has betrayed me. He thinks I don't know how much money I should be making. But stealing 3% is as good as stealing 100%. No one does this to me. No one. You follow him from his apartment, and you see where he goes. Later, we will kill him. This asshole thinks he can mess with me? If this is the best Vice City has to offer, this is gonna be easy. I like the confidence, Tommy. I love it. Very confident man. I mean, to wear a shirt like that, you have to be pretty confident. If have some kind of ego, that's for sure. I'm, I'm pleased we've, uh, we've reached the mansion. We've seen it in the definitive edition. I, I sort of did promise myself when I played the, the PS4 version of, of these games. After I was done with that, I was, I was done with that, that trilogy. But they always seem to get me back somehow. <laughs> they always bring me back. I got two words for you. Clearly I can't resist. I guess we're gonna get spotted, aren't we? Have a look through the window. Alright. What are we looking for? Looks empty to me! Oh boy. Oh shit! Don't kill him. What do you mean? What do you mean? Whoa! This is going to be difficult. Don't fall off. Oh, there's some barrels there. So Too tempted. Slow, oh boy! You better keep on running, asshole. Can I get around. Yeah. Oh, don't make me drive that scooter. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Okay, grab these wheels. Sure. <laughs> I guess this counts. He's got a beautiful beach buggy. I've got this. Try and shoot me, fool. Remember, I can't kill him, so. I mean, yeah, look at the water effects on the floor. The lighting. There's so many good aspect to this addition, but yeah, it is a little disappointing. I don't know. I'm really enjoying it, so I'm going to shut up. <laughs> also, I wouldn't be playing it, honestly, if I didn't like it. Yeah. I just don't want to sound like I'm, I'm, I'm a shield, whatever it's called. I'm overselling it. I want to be honest. Ah. What's that? What is going on here? Chill out! I think this guy's even shot me once yet. Where are you going? He's coming in circles, isn't he? You're not gonna lose me, mate. Not gonna happen, especially we're driving like that. I thought we got, I thought we got out then. <laughs> nope. Someone else. Where you going? I thought this bridge was closed. Again, no loading. Does it like, do like a weird jolt? Isn't that 
On the next bridge. Yeah. Yeah. It is very overwhelming. It's just a place. Oh. I think I found it. Okay. Well, at least we know where to go, where he's based. He might regret that, potentially. All right, back to Diaz. Back to Diaz we go. What kind of incompetent fool are you? Fool! 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 Tommy! What, Ricardo? These idiots, they're always trying to screw you. That's the problem with this business. What do you think you're doing? <laughs> These pricks have failed me miserably. Soon any mom and pop will think they could sell Gallo in Vice City. What next, huh? The stinking mafia? That gang place is a fortress at ground level. So Quentin here, Quentin, Quentin! He'll fly you over the area. Eradicate them! What do you think you're doing? What are you doing here? Hey, I've been asking around. It's obvious that Diaz jumped the deal and iced my brother. And he'll kill you too. I can take Diaz. No, listen to me. I'll handle Diaz. He's beginning to trust me. Is he beginning to trust us? Uh, I don't know. I guess so. One thing puzzling me. What's with Quentin? I don't know. I always kind of liked it. Quentin Vance. Vance? You name's Lance Vance? Hey, I got enough of that at school. Lance Vance, poor bastard. Where the hell are we headed anyway? Prawn Island. You ever fire one of those from a whirly? No. I'll get a bit of practice on the way, though. Ba 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 yeah, that's practice for me. Okay, we're almost there. Yeah, that's enough we'll practice. I'm happy. Oh, hello. Take out as many guns as you can. Then I'll set you Lance down. Lance Vance. And you're on your way. The coolest cat. You would ever know. Oh, hello. Jesus. Best shooting this car. Woo! Who's next? Yeah, helicopter's health is not great right now. Did get hit a little bit. Down below. Woo! Not too bad, not too bad. We're doing alright. How many are here though? Ridiculous. Is that guy not firing? Just staring into the abyss. Oh, nice. I see that. Barrel! Never stand next to a barrel. How many times I gotta tell ya? I'm taking them out. That barrel just went sky high. I swear this mission on the PS2 was difficult. Actually, not too bad though. Is he actually standing outside of Willows? We're just like sitting inside that makes sense. Okay, you're on your own from here. Good luck, brother. There's, there's gonna be more. Can I take the weapon? Yep, I can. I need to get up, ideally. This is where I regret not buying um oh boy. Aware. No offense, guys, but you have 
possibly the worst shot known to man. I'm sure the graffiti in here looks a lot better. It definitely wasn't that sharp. On the old original. This is it. We did it! Yeah, I swear that mission was so hard on the PS2. It wasn't that bad. I'm not sure about his piloting skills, but... Done! $2,000 for that. Ooh! All bridges are now open. We can now travel. Um, we can help out Diaz. Yeah, while we're here, why not? Let's do another mission. The fastest boat. That's so pleased with yourselves now, huh? <laughs> oh, what were you waving at thing? No more pigeon shit on my car, hey, Tommy? Guess not. <laughs> You're damn right. Now listen. You know who owns the fastest boat on the East Coast? Not offhand, no. Me! And I want it to stay that way. Every smuggler from here to Caracas has one dream. A faster boat. Rumor has it the boatyard has just completed such a vessel for some Costa Rican dickhead. And Tommy, I want that boat. Ah, I thought I got you! Where'd you come from? Pinhead! Think your are back. Okay, he wants the fastest boat. He's going to get the fastest boat. We deliver. Um, where is it? Okay, down there. Got it. Go to the boatyard and steal it. Get this done. Do I not just turn right here? Oh, okay. Yep, the bridge is officially open now. Again, I'm pretty sure in the original when we crossed this bridge, not the one before, this one, there's a load. Nope. <gasps> yes! I love this place. <laughs> you can uh, eventually own it. Um, it's, it's ice cream. Yeah. You sell ice cream. We love it. Leave that, you can leave anything. I think you can buy the car showroom as well, can't you? I'm sure you can. I do like buying my properties. You can buy the docks as well. So we're not quite in a position to do that just yet. Oops. Literally one shot with this. Boom! Oh, cops are coming. Turn us up a little bit. Oh, this, bit, this, this weapon, honestly. It's ridiculous. We need to bring it down, right? Yeah, how do we find the switch for that? Find the switch to lower the boat. Who's shooting me right now? Oh, yeah, I see ya. Okay, now I can't shoot. There we go. Where's the switch? I don't think it's here. It might be actually inside the dock bit. Ow. Guys, you know where the switch is? Oh, they're gonna actually. I didn't realize they're actually gonna attack me. Jeez. Found it. The fastest boat for Diaz. I guess that's so you can um, traffic drug, drugs very effectively. Okay. Did not want to do that. Jesus, they're not messing about, are they? We need to get out of here. Go, 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 go. This is my boat now. Oh, three stars. Oh, great. It's as quick as it 
says it should, we should be fine. It's not far. Is it done? Are we good? The fastest boat in Barcelli. Miami. Woo! There we go. And we have another mission. Oh, Mr. Let me look at this mansion, honestly. It's ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous. I love it. <laughs> I want to live here. <laughs> Who's this? Tommy, it's me, Colonel Cortez. Look, Senor, I believe you are a man who can get things done. So please help me. You can find me at the boat, huh? Okay, Cortez wants a bit of assistance again. But we are next to Diaz, so let's do that first. Diaz is paying us well right now. Supply and demand. Look at that floor. Eject plastic crap! Marble. You're doing this to me? Who do you think you are, you piece of plastic shit? Oh. Oh. Screw you! <laughs> it is my favorite El Burro movie. It died. What else can I do? It's probably not plugged in. What? Damn. No matter. I can buy a hundred more. Now, Tommy. Each month, a freelancer sails into Vice City and moors his yacht. He sells his cargo to the first boat. I want you to take the speedboat and beat all the other shitheads to it. Then you bring the cargo here. Okay. I right, just stop firing the weapon. Jesus, can you imagine being that trigger happy? Man needs to chill out a little bit. That M60, I need ammo for that. There must be somewhere I can get ammo for that. Cause boy, was it good! Literally, it was like one hit. Boom, down. Boom. Okay. Stop music. Let me guess. You thought Stop I could it. use a guardian angel. I'm just saying, you need to let me in there, my man. Now, you can feed me all this lonely tough guy crap. But I know one day, I'm going to save your ass, and you're probably going to want to kiss me. Wacko. <laughs> I think they did Lance a bit dirty. I think his face isn't we got some competition. that different from the original. Oh so, boy. Tommy, we know it was Diaz busting our deal. So why in the hell are we running errands for? The more we learn now, the less we have to learn when we take this town over. I like your style, man. Real friends. It's time for Sans Fans Dance. Coming through. I swear I remember doing this one a few times as well, actually. I think we're racing to get there first, basically. Fastest boat, it should be doable. Break. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? At the boat. Are we good? Oh. Eat that. Is this guy gonna do anything? Not anymore. <laughs> he will do not. Boat's health. He's good. Archie oh, could go a little bit quicker. On the jetty? Where? Oh, yeah, I see him. That helicopter. Oh boy. That's not friendly. Yeah. <laughs> Screw you. Is that a friendly boat? No, that doesn't look friendly. Want some of this?
It was pretty, pretty clear what Tommy wants to do. His intentions. He wants to take over this city. Oh, is that the end? Are we good? Oh. We've done it. I swear again, I remember doing that multiple times. You're a real proper grade A lunatic. Well, thank you. See you around, Tommy. Okay, Mr. Lance Vance Dance. <laughs> 10,000. Damn. South American connections. I've sure got them. Woohoo. There we go. Doing good. I didn't realize how many outfits are actually in this game. There's quite a few. Quite a few indeed. Right, let's go and help out my um my cowboy friend. He's pretty close by. He's pretty decent to us. Yo, Tommy, it's Lance. Yeah. Oh, nice to hear from you, Lance. Come on, man. Be cool, be cool. I'm in the middle of something. What do you want? Nothing. Just to say, you know, look, Tommy. We can do this thing. You and me, no problem. You know what I mean? We're going to have to do it, because otherwise we're going to be dead, Lance. We're in too far now. But thanks for the call. Speak to you later. All right. What was that about? Just sort of bedding this in a little bit. We can do this together, Tommy. Love how he always turns up in his limousine. Every time. Tommy, this is Donald Love. Donald, this is Tommy Vercetti, the latest gunslinger to come to these parts. Now, Donald, you just shut up and listen, and you might learn something. Now, nothing brings down real estate prices quicker than a good old-fashioned gang war. Except maybe a disaster, like a biblical plague or something, but that may be going too far in this case. You getting this down, you four-eyed prick? Now, recently a gang lord died. You disguise yourself and head on down and crash the funeral. Mix it up, and then hightail it. You getting this down, Donald? Well, that ought to put the coyote in the chicken coop, huh? And then we'll just sit back and watch the prices tumble. One sec, is that Donald's love from GTA 3? But why does Donald's love look so much better in GTA 3? If that makes sense. Like, his character model looks so much better. That's a bit weird. Why's that? Hmm. Suspicious. I don't get that. I get that obviously Donald Love is going to be a lot younger in this version. I love how there's like literally copycat lines from GTA 3. <laughs> it's quite funny. I've never noticed that before. Right, so we're going to get uh, the right clothes and then we're going to ruin a funeral and basically start a gang war. I'm getting some deja vu right now. I sure this is the right thing to do. Seems like Tommy's on board anyway. I feel like he's already busy enough with Diaz to start worrying about gang wars and stuff, but... We move. Okay. <laughs> he rocks it pretty well. He rocks it pretty well. Let's go. Haven't got the right vehicle, but... I need the right vehicle. <gasps> that taxi firm we can eventually buy as well. I'm, I remember buying that. Right. Let's begin the uh, the drive by, I guess. Hey guys. Get out, get out! Oh god. Get out! Ah! Wow, I'm still alive. Barely. Get out, get out, get out. Go, go, go. Get in the vehicle. Go! Go, go, go. I think she's exploding. Oh god. So how am I still alive? How am I actually still alive after that? 
What the? What the hell? That was madness. Oh, it still comes after me. Oops. Should pass any second. There we go. Woo! That was a little hairy. Yeah, that was very hairy. Oh, we did it though. Thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Feels like a good time to uh, to stop it there. And uh, hopefully you guys want to see more of Vice City Definitive Edition. Bye-bye.